then starting off with a heat protectant for your hair, I like to use Tresemme's Heat Tamer Spray. And I'm almost out of this. If not, this could be the last thing. So just hold it a little bit away from your hair. And spray. This is the last bit of it. So I'll just go here. Just let it get into the hair. And with a with flat brush, I just put the product throughout the hair, brush it into the hair some more, bottom, and we're all set. Okay, so anytime you're doing your hair, it's always best to section your hair. I'm going to be using a claw clip, starting with the bottom, placing the chip, the clip on my head. Starting off with these two sections right here. For today's hair tutorial, I'm going to be using my Chi, and it's the limited edition encrusted crystals one. I like this one because it has tourmaline and titanium plates. It's just better for when ironing your hair and it doesn't burn your hair as much as the other ones do. So just grabbing a little bit of section here, one then section, top of your head, work your way to the bottom, and then twist. Now, see I have a little bit of curl here? I like to do that. With my straining iron, I like to just twist a little bit and release, and then that's how you get that little curl at the tips. That's that. This side, same thing, just one inch hair. Up the root, so as close as I can. And just, just look at the bottom and getting that curl so that your hair doesn't look as dead. See? Now you're going to do this throughout the rest of your hair until you're done. straightening since it is naturally straight however I do get a couple waves in there which is why I like to use my straightening iron for that I'm just gonna shut this off because I'm done the hair tutorial I hope you enjoyed this tutorial it was very short and sweet it's just a matter of learning how to section your hair as you go up through um, the hair so always start from the bottom to the top and just learn that you know don't be pla don't place your straightening iron in the same section for more than a split second like try and work your way through the root of the hair down to the end because that will avoid damage to your hair and loss of hair strands secondly if your hair doesn't grab that shine like mine does because this also provides shine then just go ahead and spray your shine at this point 
besides that, um, oh, I just did this makeup tutorial, this eye tutorial. So if you'd like to check it out, I will link it down below or it will be right here as well. So you can go ahead and click that. Oh, if you're wondering what lips I'm wearing, what color of all my lips I'm wearing, it is Maybelline's Vivid Rose. It's in their Vivid's collection. I have a little bit more. And it looks like this. Uh, it's beautiful. Especially right now that it's Valentine's Day weekend. It's great for a date night look as well. Well, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos.